is the energy vibration reading for um, the hurt signs um, for the full moon reading for the month of November um, until December 15 so this energy vibration is from the 15th of November it's the full moon reading 15th of November until December 15 okay so I'm seeing a pattern that is basically coming back this is the energy for um, the Sun sign people and this is the energy for the moon sign people so we are going to be looking at the Sun sign people some of you Sun sign people are going to be dealing with the Aquarians okay the Aquarians are, um, are, are the, you know once you guys and I want to say please like share these videos and remember that the first um, day of this video um, will be done for the general public but for the people who are um, connecting with us um, on on demand that is going to be going further okay so please like share these videos please thumbs up thumbs up thumbs up if even you're not going on um, to go ahead with on demand please thumbs up these videos it is very important that we get the energy of the moon um, readings out there so we're going to start and look at the fire sign people now the fire sign people we're seeing the Aquarians coming in and the energy of the moon so the Aquarians are here and these are some psychic Aquarians that are coming in now the energy of the Taurus is the energy of uh, um, the um, the effect of the Tauruses most of you Tauruses are going to be affected by the moon and the Aquarians now some secrets could be coming out about the Aquarians so Tauruses who are work, working with the Aquarians some energy of secrets could be coming out some secrets could be um, coming out there are intuition um, a situation that is going to be affecting you where information is going to be coming into you some of you could be dealing with an Aquarius we're going to be looking to see how that is going to be affecting you but you Tauruses you are here standing in this um, full moon and this is good because you just had the Taurus full moon and this is a very good that you Tauruses are here now as we look at the hurt sign people there is going to be things that is going to be removing out of your life um, you earth sign people's the energies of the planets are working um, you have Saturn which is in your birth chart at this moment you have mercury that is going retrograde and then you have Uranus so for you Capricorn are you um, I said Capricorn so um, it's gonna affect the Capricorns and you could be having situation with the um, the air sign people the Aquarians and Gemini because here is the, the fall of the Aquarians and Gemini with the energy of Saturn because Saturn is the energy for the Capricorns now as we look for the rest of you the psychic and for the Taurus is something is going to be leaving your life that needs to leave your life so whatever it is for you Taurus is that is about to leave your life you need to let it go because obviously this thing needs to um, leave your life what I'm seeing is the Aquarius and the energy of the water now the Aquarians and the energy of the water some of you are going to be dealing with uh, um, the Gemini's the Pisces and the cancers okay because when an energy of water comes up it always has to do with the Pisces um, the Pisces the cancer and with the Gemini so it could be people who have uh, um uh, who are pisces cancer or scorpion and have gemini sun moon horizon or aquarius sun moon horizon that is coming in these people could be leaving your life whoever you are once you're an earth sign please please remember to listen also um to your um uh, your um this because this is uh, for the earth people so listen to which other um, zodiac element that affects you in your birth chart okay so this is for the Sun rising earth sign people this is for the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn now what I've done because I've changed up the reading as you notice I'm always always changing up the reading so we need to um, be affiliate with more things and understand more things in our lives so I'm always um, changing around things which is very important it's a good to have changes coming up in your life now we're going to be looking to see who exactly 
are going to be affecting um, you guys okay because um, this is what this is all about how it's going to affect you and which solar plex chakra it's going to affect you who are the people and uh, what are the people that is going to be coming in what aspect of yourself this is going to be affecting and remember like share these videos and uh, um, it's good to see the extended version because it's all about money love and uh, a general extent of, of what is going to be coming up uh, November and December so let's see for the Aquarians um, some of you are going to be having some growth uh, with um, the Aquarians the energy of the moon pray 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 no matter what is going on pray ask for forgiveness you Tauruses have to find a way to ask for forgiveness for what has ever whatever that has been done to you we have the energy of Saturn coming in and and we have listened to the instinct so Saturn and, and this is good you know whoever has Saturn in their birth chart at this time your instinct is going to be on eye targets your instinct is going to be on eye target mercury is here and you're having some guilt now mercury in retrograde there is some guilt that is going on um, for some of you but uh, we're going to be looking at that in a deeper form we have wisdom Uranus is bringing in wisdom and that is good at least it's not taking out something it's bringing you something and this is good let's look at Gemini what is happening with the Gemini's there's some grief with the people who are in relationship with the Gemini's now recovery there's a recovery that is going to be happening now some of you have vanity you have vanity vanity is the outcomes of this full moon reading what it is what it is that you want to bring forward in your life is going to be good now as you look some of you so, uh, someone it could be an Aquarius and this is for the Sun sign people some of you Sun sign people could be dealing with an Aquarius that is going to bring some birth in your life and when we say bring birth in your life is that this person is going to be coming in and pushing you forward in your life with certain things uh, maybe you're stuck on certain things maybe certain things have been very very much stuck for you and they're going to be coming in and pushing you forward in a way whether in work situation whether in your personal life but they're going to be coming in to push you forward and this is good the energy of the moon is here the energy of the moon um, your angels and guides are saying praying and ask for what it is okay your angels and guides this is how they come in via the intuition they're saying pray and ask for what it is that you need you need to pray and ask for what it is that you need call upon your guiding angels pray light a candle it is a full moon it is good light a candle write your wishes in dream of what you need to be happening now obviously because this is a urge reading you Taurus is are here um, whatever the situation is you Taurus need to forgive forgive there is a situation that is going to be happening and you need to bring forgiveness in your life whatever the situation is you need to bring forgiveness in your life as we look here the planet of Saturn is here and for you um, moon people this is the energy of uh, um, Saturn is coming in with the intuition now Saturn is going to be making sure that your intuition is right on target so uh, from 15 November until 15 December um, to your birthday and in your your birthday zodiac Saturn is just going to make sure that your intuition is so high and so aligned for the people who um, Saturn is in your birth chart now Mercury is going to be going in retrograde at that time some of you are going to be having some guilt whatever this guilt is you need to let it go you need to bring in healing and let go of this guilt because whatever this guilt that is coming in with mercury going in retrograde you need to let go of this guilt and you need to move forward in your life as we look we have the energy of uranius and uranius is bringing in some positive energy and wisdom is coming in uranius is basically bringing in wisdom for you guys and this is good because i'm afraid of uranius when it comes in the birth chart but right now you're seeing that it's bringing in some wisdom as we move forward let's see what is going to be affecting us and how and where it is going to be affecting us um 
we have with growth um, the nine of Pentacles so um, some of you and Aquarius is going to be coming in to help you to heal your financial stability so um, um, money is going to be there and especially the Aquarius, the people who are in business with the Aquarius money is going to be coming in for you guys now with the moon um, we have the energy of the Knight of Swords. So some of you could be dealing with someone. Uh, it could be your son. It could be your partner. You need to pray. You need to pray. Okay. Whoever this person is, and whatever the situation, you need to pray to get rid of this person because this is if this person is going to be doing some serious, serious thing, and you need to pray to release yourself from this person. This person is an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra, uh, who is between the ages of for um 40 and 40 um 25 and 45 you need to pray and ask that this person being released out of your life okay for you Tauruses, a wonderful energy eight of cups um whatever is happening to you Tauruses, you need to ask for forgiveness and walk away from this situation the situation is not serving you anymore so um you Tauruses have to really 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 ask for forgiveness um, ask for forgiveness um, for what is transpiring at this moment you need to call upon the universe ask the universe for forgiveness for whoever who have done you wrong and injustice and walk away from it because it has something to do with your vanity it has something to do with your materialistic world and that is what is transpiring so whatever the situation is you just need to let it go and walk away from it okay let's move forward and see what else is coming in we have Saturn with the instinct what is happening with Saturn with your instinct now you need to protect yourself okay because whenever this comes up is that listen to your intuition obviously there is a situation that is happening you need to listen to your intuition because obviously whatever the situation is whatever is happening you need to listen and protect yourself ask the universe to protect you while you go through um, this sense because whatever is happening there is some protection that is coming listen to your intuition because that's the way you're going to be able to protect yourself now mercury and the energy of guilt is coming up for mercury mercury the energy of guilt is coming up and you're seeing the truth to a situation do not feel bad for whatever has transpired okay don't feel bad for whatever has transpired let go of the guilt call upon the universal angels and said I'm asking you for divine intervention in this situation please help me to release this guilt of whatever because someone um, is going to uh, someone has been keeping you blind and with mercury in retrograde you're feeling bad because something happened to someone and it could be um, Pisces cancer or a scorpion but he's gonna he or she is going to be recovering from this situation okay it is a lesson for him and it is an art lesson for him but he will recover there is going to be coming a resolution to the situation Uranus with the wisdom is here so let's look at what is happening Uranus with wisdom and it's the nine of swords okay so some of you is as if you're trying to find inner wisdom and guidance inner wisdom and guidance seven of swords is here ladies and gentlemen there are some deceptive things that will be happening around you open up yourself open your eyes because someone is trying to steal something from you because the energy of vanity is here with the energy of the seven of swords so someone in um, this time period could be trying um, to take something from you but it's not going to be happening um, because what is happening is that there is there is a transition that is coming in and you're seeing this happening and this is really going to be happening for you guys so this is good okay so um, ladies and gentlemen I want to wish you a very very wonderful full moon um, for the extending of this reading I'm asking you guys uh, to um, um, just connect via uh,